This is Hidden Killers Week in Review. A look back at the most prolific stories of the week. Uh, let's just uh, play a, a little theory here in uh, in practice. Uh, let's say he does get a new trial. Uh, do you think the defense of Alec Murdoch is just going to present the same defense as the last time? I would highly doubt it, but I'm curious as to what's been going through your mind. If you were in those shoes, where would you take it uh, if he does get another chance? You know, um, they're, they're going to have to pull out all the stops. They're going to probably do new investigation, try to uncover new evidence that might lead to new defenses. And, and that's not uncommon at a second trial. One thing Murdoch is going to have to contend with, though, is that he testified for days and he made some uh, damning admissions during the, the, that testimony. And he's going to be married to those. He's not going to be able to get out of those. Even if he doesn't testify at the second trial, the jury is likely going to hear about some of the um, unfavorable stuff that he said while on that uh, witness stand. And so, um, you know, is it going to be some sort of augmented, modified hybrid defense that's kind of like the one before, but a little different? Um, that's what's going to be exciting about it if there is a new yeah. trial. And 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 I don't mean to, to diminish the gravity of it. It's, it's extremely serious, but just from a law nerd's perspective. Oh, yeah. Yeah. I mean, I think, I mean, it, it's obviously a horrible, horrible thing. People lost their lives here. But at the same point, yeah, those of us who are watching it closely are just like, well, this is going to be something to see. Uh, how much uh, from the former trial can be admissible into a new trial, especially considering the circumstances, uh, if in fact they do say, yeah, there was jury tampering? Can his testimony, I mean, if can the prosecution go and play that back if they really wanted to in a new trial? Or are some of those things off limits because they basically took place in a trial that was deemed you know, not fair? You know, evidentiary rules vary by jurisdiction, but generally speaking, um, former testimony under oath regarding the same uh, matter that's being determined at a future trial is is often admissible. Um, and and so, uh, what Murdoch has said, and and especially um, the, the things about. Uh, you know, screwing over his former clients and taking millions of dollars and that kind of thing. Um, those potentially come in too if Murdoch's credibility is at issue in the new trial, assuming there is a new trial. Mm -hmm. So I think a big chunk of it could come in and they're going to have to shuck and jive around that on the defense side. Just like, hey, here's a rerun. This is, has happened earlier. Uh, let's watch this. Do you think Alec would take the stand at a second trial? Uh, obviously, Alec is going to do what Alec wants to do. I can't imagine... Uh, it was his attorneys who said, yeah, get up there. I mean, unless it was just a Hail Mary at that point in time. Dude, Tony, he cannot help himself. He is absolutely going to get on that stand. That, that's that, that, This guy, um, you know, it, I'm no psychologist, but, but he seems to have some potentially narcissistic tendencies. He likes to hear himself talk, you know, and he's articulate and he's sharp, but, but as time goes on and with a seasoned prosecutor, like in the first case, um, he's going to talk himself into some pits that yeah. he might not be able to climb out of. And he did that in the first trial. Will he do that in the second trial? I think it's highly likely. Uh, if he does granted a new trial, how far down the road do you foresee that uh, being till that takes place? You know, um, I, the wheels of justice move pretty darn slowly, but um, in this case, I think a lot of the investigation for the prosecution side has already been done. It's not like they have to hire a bunch of new experts and go out to a bunch of new crime scenes or anything like that. So that part's already taken care of. I suspect if there is a new trial, he is in custody. Um, he would have speedy trial rights. And yeah. so I think that um, that trial could come to pass more quickly than, than we all think, perhaps even in the next six months or excuse oh. me, the six months after the judge decides on the new trial. Well, it's going to be fascinating to watch.